Happy New Year, guys. Welcome to Man About Cake. I'm your host, Joshua John Russell, and today we're doing the winner of the Mac Fan Challenge Cake. I'm gonna build a three-tiered spice cake filled with matcha green tea buttercream and finished with an awesome bottling chocolate bonsai tree. Let's do it! All right, so we're gonna start by breaking down an eight-inch spice cake. Garbage cake. All right, I'm gonna clean up my crumbs and then we'll fill it. I'm gonna fill this guy with green tea buttercream. By the way, if you want either of these recipes, you know where they are. The eye up there or the description box below. While you're down there, hit subscribe. It's not a cool color. It's awesome. It's beautiful. Why'd you choose to go makta here? Um, uh, why did I? I think it's a lot of people mentioned that it would be cool to, to, to see like a matcha green tea cake actually, but I thought it'd be cooler if it was in the buttercream. Brandon, are you sad that Frank the Tank didn't win? Shocked. <laughs> Utterly shocked. <laughs> Maybe we'll make them for your birthday. We can make that as your groom's cake. I, I don't know if that's gonna fly. You don't think Anahita will like a big Frank the Tank on one of her tables at her wedding? Probably not. Brandon, we could do a spin-off and make a, make it ourselves. I'll call it Man About Tanks. That would be hilarious. I'll film it if you guys want to make a Frank the Tank. That would be really funny. One more layer. We'll get this guy in the cooler. We'll bring her back, cut her, crumb coat her, final coat her. Let's go. By the way, congratulations to Danny who came up with this awesome bonsai tree design. James, will you read what Danny wrote on Instagram? Hi Joshua, if you are reading this, it's an honor, even if I'm not the winner. I'm one of your subscribers and I've watched every one of your videos. When I go off to university, I want to study and design, so it was, this is a dream come true. It's a bonsai tree that grew into the cake, and I mean, you are the man about cake, you can do anything. Plus, in my point of view, it would kind of be the same technique as your octopus cake or choctopus. Anyway, I love you and it would be a dream come true, really. This is the same technique, we're using copper coil. Nice. Well, congratulations, you'll be getting a package from me and the guy. So we're gonna start to build the tree. I'm gonna build this over a dummy form and then we'll get it the way we want it and then we'll transfer it to the real cake because the cake is cake. Um, I don't wanna be digging into it too much and damage the cake. So we're gonna build it with copper coil and it's gonna feed all the way through the cake. This tree's gonna be kind of heavy because it's made out of modeling chocolate. All right, so that copper is not touching the cake, I'm actually gonna wrap this as well. All right, now we're gonna feed this all the way through. And the tree sort of comes off to the side, like this, like that. Then I'm gonna cut it, because it's a little too long now. I always do things that are struggles. Why do I do this to myself? Because I'm a man <laughs> about cake. <laughs> there we go. Now we've got our support. You're gonna be a tree. Okay, so I've got some modeling chocolate here, some dark modeling chocolate. We're gonna start with the trunk. And guess what shape it is? Carrot thing. Carrot thing. <laughs> I'm gonna use some various tools to get my texture in, but I'm gonna start, I found this cool mat at a cake show, and it kinda has like this wood grain on it. So I'm gonna roll it in here first just to get it started. All right, now I'm gonna get some pieces for the roots. Same deal, carrots, I'm gonna texture it. So my favorite thing about modeling chocolate is that you can get rid of lines with your fingers. If you have cold hands, you may wanna use a tool like this where you can actually make the lines disappear. So these little areas where I sort of ruin my texture, I'll just come back in with a tool and cut in some little grooves. So I also have this little wire, and some of the longer branches, I'm actually going to feed on this little wire so that I make sure when I pipe the royal leaves, it's not too heavy and makes them sort of sink. Yeah. 
Yeah. Tommy, what's your uh, New Year's resolution? My New Year's resolution is to read at least four books in the month. Mm. I haven't read four books in my life. Really? No. All right, we're gonna feed this guy through. So this wire will give him support. Kind of looks like someone just dancing. She's being dipped. She's having the time of her life. Now I got my tree where I want it. I'm gonna work on the branches down below. I did a couple and I'm gonna show you how I did it on this side. By the way, I'm wearing my Crafty shirt because there's a special announcement at the end of the show from Crafty. And guess who made this shirt? Who? Brandon! What? He did! You're super, I don't know, he said he made it. No, did I you? designed the logo. Ah. The raglan tee. It's a softball. Like a baseball tee, yeah. Because we played baseball and I got a shirt and we got whooped <laughs> by a CrossFit gym. Who puts sewers and bakers against a CrossFit gym? Right? <laughs> I'm gonna make uh, part of this come out of one tier and then go to the other. So we'll smush it against this tier. It should stick. Should is the word there. It did, it did stick. I would do that. <laughs> All right, add a little texture to him. Yeah. Stick. Now I got all my tree pieces like I like them, so we're gonna cover our cake and fawn it. We'll stack it and then do our airbrushing. Can you guys play any instruments? That was a good mouse trumpet. Okay, now we're gonna stack our cakes together using bubble tea straws. Now it's time to airbrush. What I did to seal my cakes up is I actually put a little bit of royal icing in between each tier and smooth it with my finger so there's no seam. So the way Danny sketched this out, it's all the colors of the rainbow, but they're not in rainbow order. So don't kill the messenger. <laughs> I'm doing it just like the sketch. We're gonna start with yellow. Thank you to Craftsy for hooking up this awesome prize package for Danny. You guys get a gift too. They're actually giving away a free subscription to the Craftsy website. So you can watch any class you want. I would suggest watching mine. Um, the links are in the description box below. Let's talk about what Danny's getting though. First and foremost, a Cake Slayer t-shirt. It even has a Man cake on the back. An offset spatula. Cheetos from Brandon. Chips. Can I, can I have some now? Uh, no, you want keto, you can't eat this. We got some garbage cake. That cinnamon swirl cake, it's delicious. Let me get some of that. No, this is all for Danny. Cake pan, we've got some Madagascar bourbon vanilla, my favorite. This fun scraper, this actually makes really cool uh, designs into the side of your cake. Uh, or it can just be a smoother. Some bubble tea straw is my favorite. A turntable, this thing is awesome. Good for starting cake designers as well. You can travel with it too. If you have to travel with the cake, throw it in your suitcase. And then this I think is really cool. It's a 55 piece tip set. It's like every tip you could possibly imagine. And it comes in its own little case. So Danny, this is all for you. Thank you for entering the competition. I'm super excited to make your cake. And for all of you who entered, I seriously was blown away by your creativity. Hopefully we'll get to do it again. Let's finish the cake. All right, now it's time to put our tree on top of the cake. I'm actually gonna get a little taller here. And we're gonna take a dowel, feed it through so we can make a hole. Then we will slide this back out and put the copper pipe through the hole. Go right in the middle here. Now I'm gonna add all the rest of my pieces on the tree and then my branches down below. All right, for our final touch, we're gonna to pipe the leaves. I actually put two different colors of green in here so it has some variations in my leaves. Let's pipe them. Bonsai cake is complete. Congratulations to Danny for winning our Mac Fan Challenge. I really hope you enjoy your gifts. Hey, comment below and let me know how you think I did with your masterpiece. 
Guys, don't forget about the free Crafty subscription as well. That's down there. Hit subscribe while you're down there too. Next week, we're doing an awesome brunch cake. It'll be super fun. I can't wait to taste this matcha butter cake. Mmm, I think I just found inner peace. Don't forget about the Crafty free subscription. It's in the description box. It'll blow up. I knew it was gonna happen. I was running out of gas. Hey, comment below and tell me how you think I did on your masterpiece. Subscribe right down there as well. <sighs> you know that closings are, they are my, my thing. I'm so good at them. This thing, it won't turn because it's stuck in the wall.